星光灿烂的宇宙，对人类来说一直是充满魅力、遐想和不懈探索的神秘地方。近十几年来，科学家们更是在广阔的宇宙中发现了无数奇妙的现象，包括宇宙加速膨胀、大量的伽马射线爆发、超新星爆发、众多星系或星系团的剧烈碰撞、重组以及新星系的诞生等等。许多发现甚至对传统的万有引力理论和宇宙观构成了严重挑战。这段时间里的重大天文发现，比过去任何时期都要多得多。因此，科学家们把这段时间称为天文学的黄金时期。在接下来王培的采访报道中，将逐一为您介绍这些新发现，以及这些发现对我们的影响和启示。坐落在美国马里兰州巴尔的摩市的美国太空望远镜科学研究院，就是著名的哈勃太空望远镜的老家。这里专门从事有关哈勃太空望远镜的计划、安排、调度和数据信息处理。1990年，这架耗资15亿美元、至今为止人类送往太空的最大的望远镜被送入预定轨道。开辟了地球上第一个轨道天文台。Hubble has a very tiny field of view, so whenever it looks, it looks at something very specific. Okay, but where it looks is decided by astronomers from all over the world. Make proposals at what Hubble should look at, and then we gather here. Uh, groups of experts in all the areas of astronomy, which decide which observations Hubble will actually do, and then you know every year we get about a thousand proposals, and only about one out of six or so is being selected, and then it's those things that Hubble observes. 虽然相对于广袤的宇宙来言。只有一只眼睛的哈勃所能捕捉到的信息显得微不足道，但到目前为止，他已经通过向地面上的天文学家们发送无线电波的方式，提供了无数极有价值的图片。哈勃发回的观测数据使科学家们对宇宙的研究不断取得突破性的进展。两千零六年七月，利维奥博士从哈勃十六年来的赫赫功绩中精心筛选出十项最突出的贡献。他表示，哈勃不仅为天文学家提供了前所未有的细节，还让全世界的人在家中也能一睹宇宙的奇景。历史上很少有望远镜能够像哈勃望远镜这样，对天文学研究产生如此深远的影响。So there are many things that Hubble found. I should say. I mean, there are more than 6,000 scientific papers that have been written on the basis of Hubble data. But if I had to rank, you know, what is the most exciting science, is the discovery of what we call dark energy. You see, our universe. We knew already since the 1920s that our universe is expanding. But we thought that this expansion should be slowing down because of gravity. Like you know, if you throw something up, uh, it, gravity slows it down. Yes. But since 1998, we discovered that the expansion of the universe not only is not slowing down, it is speeding up,、mm. and this is being pushed by something that we now call dark energy, and that is. Three quarters of the energy of the universe is in the form of this dark energy, but which we don't know what it is. So this is probably the most exciting discovery that Hubble has done. Yes, this is a dying star. 利维奥博士介绍说，科学家们从比较这两张哈勃的照片中，发现了宇宙的加速膨胀和暗能量的存在。That we use to measure this dark energy. Uh, that is pushing the universe to accelerate,、oh. and so we don't know what it is, but it appears to permeate all space. Yes, it's, it it fills all of space, and it has 
you, you know, gravity normally is attractive. Two masses attract each other. But this dark energy has a repulsive force. So it pushes the universe to accelerate. So, you know, if I take my keys out from my pocket and I throw them up like this, yes, gravity here slows it down and brings it back, right? But what this dark energy would do is I throw these keys up and it pushes them up to accelerate. I see. This is what it does to the whole universe. Mm. So the whole universe, the expansion is accelerating. Mm. This is what we see. 对于暗能量的本质，目前科学家们仍旧一无所知。但最近的发现显示，宇宙中四分之三的能量来自于暗能量，而这个人们现在还看不见的能量，却主宰了宇宙的未来。Oh, absolutely. This is this is the biggest challenge, perhaps, that physics is facing today, is to understand what is the nature of this dark energy. Uh, I mean, physicists all over the world are now scratching their heads, trying to find out what this dark energy is all about. 宇宙加速膨胀和暗能量的发现，对传统的宇宙大爆炸理论构成了巨大的挑战。许多物理学家都在重新审视现在流行的宇宙形成和演化理论